Hey Oil Campers and Relammers here with you today to talk about the wonderful oil oregano. Now this is an oil you might not use all the time, but you are going to be so thankful that you have it when you need it. It is a powerhouse oil and its main properties are that it is antibacterial, antifungal, antiparasitic, antiseptic to the respiratory system, antiviral, and it's an immune support. It does so many different things, you guys. So it is an awesome one to have in your arsenal, and you're going to be so thankful that you have it when you need it. So I'm going to talk quickly about two of the main ways that we use it. So for immune health and also for any skin um, needs. So the one thing I want to quick mention is that when you hear the word oregano, I want you to automatically think dilution. You've got to dilute this oil. It is a very hot oil, and so it can be very uncomfortable um, when put directly onto the skin, okay? So you definitely want to dilute it appropriately. Um, so topically for immune support, um, if you want to pair it with some other great immune protective oils, you know, we have the On Guard, Lemon, Melaleuca, Frankincense. They make a great combination of um, supportive oils and protective oils for your body, especially during the winter season, right? So to use it, you could just dilute it and put it topically on the bottoms of your feet and topically up your spine. Or we also have these handy veggie capsules that you can just pop them open and you can add your oil directly into it, pop it closed, and down the hatch it goes. So one um, kind of blend of oils that you could do, we call it the flume bomb, frankincense, lemon, oregano, on guard, and melaleuca. All five of those come in those starter packages. And you would just put one to two drops of each of those oil in this veggie cap. Down the hatch it goes, and it really helps support your body when you feel like something's coming on or you know that something is going on and you're achy and feverish and chills. Um, so that's when you really want to break out the oregano to just nip it in the butt. The other product we have with oregano is the oregano touch roller. Now this is one that's going to be really fabulous for your kiddos and for people with sensitive skin. So it's the oregano oil already pre-diluted with fractionated coconut oil in a roller bottle. So then you can quickly apply it up and down the spine, on the bottoms of the feet. Just remember that when you are actively fighting something off, you want to use this frequently. Another product that we do have that has oregano in it is the On Guard Plus Soft Gels. So the plus in that On Guard Plus Soft Gel is oregano and one other oil, Melissa. So because oregano is such a great antiviral, when paired with On Guard, it really, really helps fight whatever's going on in your body. So those are, those are just some other products you might want to add onto your LRP quickly. The On Guard Plus Soft Gels are a must-have throughout the year. Okay, so let's talk quickly about using it with your skin. Again, you want to think of dilution. But you know, sometimes you might have those bumps or something on your skin that is like a little warty wart <laughs> um, that you want to get rid of, right? So oregano is going to be very helpful to that. Now what you want to do is take some of your coconut oil and apply it directly around the bump and onto the skin. And then you'll take a cotton ball with a drop of oregano and apply it to that. And you're protecting the skin already because you have the fractionated coconut oil already there. Um, but the oregano is going to help reduce that bump, okay? Now, you have to be consistent with it. Um, it's not going to go away magically in a day, right? It could take a couple of weeks to a month. Um, but if you're consistent with it, and you know, you could use a cotton ball or even a Q-tip to like really get direct access to it. Um, but if you do that two times a day consistently, you are going to see results, which is pretty fabulous. So the other really quick thing I want to talk about with oregano is for safety stuff. If by chance you do get some on directly on your skin that's not diluted and it's burning and it's very uncomfortable, take your coconut oil and 
douse your hand and wipe it off. You're not going to want to use water because the water is actually going to spread the oregano and then make it uncomfortable in a larger area. So again, remember, oregano, dilution. But it is an awesome oil that you are going to be so thankful that you have. So get it out. Give it a little sniff. Smell the power. <laughs> and uh, enjoy using it. Thanks, guys.